am outside at night. Let's see. Wow, the front view camera doesn't make it look like daytime or it doesn't make it look like there's light, but the rear view camera does. So I'm outside, as you probably can tell. And I am gonna show you a target. And this target is with a like a junior size variable pump rifle has an adjustable stock on it um, and I'm using uh, Winchester round nose pellets made in Spain Daisy slash Gamble company and um, I bought them at tractor supply and they seem okay in some rifles especially the variable pumps. Right here's my shot group right here at 21 feet. Um, and the reason I um, adjusted it to 21 feet was because that's the distance from the chair to where the gopher's been popping up. So um, I paced it out. So it's my paces for 21 uh, feet or seven yards. Um, so for me, that's uh, where I wanted to sight in at. I'll show you the rifle in a second. It's got peep sights on it. Um, the safety is manual. And there's two places you can um, do the safety. There's one inside the trigger guard and one outside. It's the same safety just that's located in two spots. And it's easier to turn, put the safety on outside the trigger guard, and it's easier to take the safety off from inside the trigger guard. I'll go show you the gun. Okie dokie. Like I said before, I'm going to show you the gun. This is the M4 TAC, the adjustable stock, and a variable pump, peep sights on it. The charging handle, you pull it back and put the pellets in right here. And um, the safety is right there. Underneath, you pull it, to put the safety on, and it works better when you push it forward inside the trigger guard to shut it off. But you can do it both ways. You can pull it back in here if you want, a little harder. So this shoots... Uh, like tell it's close to 700 feet per second. This thing is a little monster. And um, I have other Gamo junior size rifles that shoot about 500 feet per second with lead. And they're really accurate. But for this one, um, it's a good deal. I paid a little over 30 bucks for it. It's like a $100 rifle. You know? And, uh, I've seen a lot of sites that were listing it around the world. Uh, I got a good deal, you know. I think I paid 30, $33 or $34 for it. This thing is great. It's the best shooting variable pump rifle I have of all the rifles. It has uh, rifling in it. So, I really like it. Cool.